Welcome back to my channel. So for today, we have a very festive and chill day ahead. So we're trying to slow down and chill. Uh, Carl is very chill. Can you see him down there? And we're listening to our Disney area music. We've just finished having our green juice for the day. It wasn't very green, it was packed with beets. So it was like more like a hot pink color, but I drank the whole thing and it was delicious. It tasted like strawberries. And now I am mixing my little electrolyte mix that I seem to be loving lately. And I feel like right now it's saving me because I just feel like I need to that extra hydration. And I'm gonna go downstairs and do some yoga. But this morning, Andre and I opened a couple of gifts. So we actually are not doing Christmas with my parents. And I don't know if you can tell, I did my best to conceal it. I shed a couple of tears. I would hate for my mom to know that, but it was emotional. It was, it's sad. It's just, it's upsetting, but it's the right thing and it's okay. But this is, I'm, I feel like I'm being like letting you into my life right now. I, I had a moment, but this is like, my mom sent this with her gifts that she got. I don't want to cry again. She sent this. I don't know if you can see what it says on the top. And it's like, he wrote the best that he could. It breaks my heart. My grandma. <sighs> it's tough. It's a tough year. So my mom, got me like the best thing my dad also um they sent over look at what they sent every year i show you guys all the decorations and i'm like this is from my parents look at what they got us like this little wooden mickey and mini set aren't they so cute aren't they adorable love these so we had a good morning and they also they sent over a pink bottle which is gonna happen probably on christmas night with andre and i pink bev she had been looking for it forever. Now, those of you guys that are in the States are probably like, yeah, that's easy to get. Not in Canada, it's super hard to find. So they're heroes. I'm gonna go downstairs and do some yoga. I'm probably gonna wash my hair today because it is in need. And, oh, I have placed an Instacart order. Like a grown up. Andre said, hey, I'm gonna go out and do groceries for us. And I was like, I've got it, I'll do the groceries. So that way we don't have to go out and about. And it is on the way to be delivered right now. So I ordered everything that we need for our green juices, for our Christmas breakfast for Andre and I, and then for our evening together, we're just gonna do like a little mixed, I know this is shocking, a mixed charcuterie board. It's like our favorite thing ever. So I ordered some cheeses, I ordered some seedless grapes, I ordered some stuff to make French toast for Christmas morning, and just a couple things to bake, cause I think I'm gonna bake today also. So the plan today is yoga, clean up, hydrate my life, and probably get dressed in something normal. I'm obsessed with this onesie. It's literally all I'm gonna wear until the end of time. And I don't think I need to wrap any more gifts. I think Andre might be wrapping a couple last gifts and then we're gonna, you know, prep for Christmas. So if you guys wanna come with me today, then just keep watching. I, hear the jingle bells, people singing about love. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's been snowing out. And it was, it was like Christmas snowing, you know, like that soft, beautiful snow, like the way that it falls. So that was happening this morning. I've got my yoga gear on. I've got my new Gymshark gear on, which I'm very excited about. There's some exciting things coming. And my order is being delivered. Ooh, and I have a DHL order coming in from Confectionery Soaps Co. Yay. Okay, let's make our way downstairs. I brought some socks and an extra sweater down with me. And I should probably fill up my water. You gonna come with? You're about to lose your mind though whenever the doorbell rings for our food delivery. So I think I'm gonna bring down my laptop to stream some yoga. I've got my water down here. I also put down a space heater and we've got our gifts wrapped for Andre's family and his sister's kids. So hopefully that goes smoothly and we're able to see them, but I don't know what's going on. So we're kind of just going with the flow and trying to stay like chill about the whole thing. It's just, it's hard to process, but it's okay. Next year it'll be like, but a distant memory, I hope. <laughs> Food's here. Carl's like our doorbell without a doorbell. Carl, back up. Do you, do you want me to get it? Back up. 
You're grabbing everything. Yep. Look at our cute thing that we put out for our drivers. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna freeze up here. We did this for the drivers. And there's like a little fairy light in here. So it glows at night too whenever they deliver stuff. Cute, right? Okay. Let's see what we got. A lot of stuff. Well, it's for like our Christmas, you know? Mm -hmm. Celery for our green juices. Bruschetta for us for Christmas dinner. Oh, and I got like charcuteries. Oh, and I got us, yeah, more charcuteries. And then smoked salmon. Oh, Carl's gonna be excited by that. Mm -hmm. I got some breakfast patties, thing, like potato pancakes. Mm -hmm. I just wanna say that word. Some little mini hot dogs. Oh, these are the crackers that I got. Mm -hmm. Sesame, black sesame rice crackers, mm -hmm. gluten free. Mm -hmm. Syrup. Mm -hmm. Candy canes, candy corns, beets, beets, roasted garlic, hummus, do you like that? Mm -hmm. Gouda, what's this? Oh, baking powder, you know, you never know. Gouda, balderson, mm -hmm. some green grapes for charcuterie, more charcuterie. I got this one, like an antipasto, mm -hmm. antipasto misto. Say it like a real Italian. Wait, didn't I say that I already got bacon? Oh no, that was charcuterie. I got bacon for our breakfast. Carrots. Oh my gosh. Oh, I just wanted two white potatoes. He got me two bags. Oh no. I just wanted two potatoes. It's like I'm cooking Christmas dinner. It's okay, we can make potatoes for the next little while. <laughs> Maybe your mom wants it. Some eggs. Babe, I saved us a trip to the grocery store. That place is an insane asylum this time of year. What movie is that from? Mm, I don't know. Santa Claus? No. It's from the Deck of Halls movie. Fries? Didn't I already? No, you got the... Oh, the potato pancakes. Mm -hmm. And then more rice crackers, because I didn't know what kind you wanted. With cream for the Christmas pudding. Wow, that's bread. a really big vanilla extract. Did he not bring bread? He brought the bread, but it's under a cucumber. It's a little bit squished. Mm. Oh but yeah, I'll make you French toast. No, it's okay, that bread is durable. <laughs> She's a tough cookie, that bread. Uh -huh. Okay, so this is our grocery haul. Our little Christmas grocery haul. You'd think we're a family of 15. It's not that much, right? Okay. <laughs> Don't have anything in the fridge. That clears my mind I'm all for a good start I hear those jingle bells People singing about love It feels like I'm a kid Like I'm forever young And that's why I want to sing about The Christmas on its way A reason to hang around And celebrate this day Everyone's smiling and it's snowing, it's the time of year again I'm happy you're here, my winter wonderland All right, so Andre and I just had like a delicious lunch. He had leftover takeout, but my lunch was the leftovers of the stew that I made the other day, which was very good. I'm turning the fireplace back on because it is getting chilly up in here and I'm still wearing my little short shorts. It's like little Santa short shorts. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna turn on, is this on? Yes, now you're on. So I'm gonna do some baking. I'm literally taking you through like a full holiday prep routine. Even though we're not having people over, I still like to have a really clean house. I still like to bake. I'm not gonna bake as much as I usually do just because it'll just be Andre and I. But one thing that I love, speaking of grandparents, cause I know I already talked about my grandfather, but my grandmother used to make um, Christmas pudding. Whoa. Let's see. There we go, now we have lights, that's better. She used to make Christmas pudding, it's a very English thing to make, and it's delicious. And it's honestly not that unhealthy other than the sugar, but I'm gonna use some cane sugar. But it's basically, it's so weird. Like people that have never had it often think it's very strange, but it's like raisin based and it's very cinnamon and cloves. But the base of it is not bread. It would be kind of like a bread pudding, but there's no bread in it. It's carrots and potatoes, which is so strange, but it is like, it's my favorite thing. 
and I make it really well because she taught me herself. So you have to steam it for like three and some hours. So I'm gonna make that right now, but funny story, I usually call my mom to bother her for the recipe because for whatever reason, every year I lose it. And for the past couple of years, I just reference my own videos. I reference my own videos for a lot of things. Like it's embarrassing how many things I reference my own videos for. Baking is one of them. How to make a fort is another one. I leave Cole's notes on my, <laughs> it's horrible. So I'm going to get to baking and I'm gonna maybe make a little hot chocolate or something for Andre. He's upstairs playing Call of Duty in his office. We're just having a chill day. It's lovely. Okay, let's bake. A very exciting parcel just arrived. So I, I don't know what to share first. I have to share like my favorite parts of it. So whipped soap, it's basically like a minty mocha. It's Mickey's minty mocha. And then this is a sugar scrub. So good, so good. But listen, my two favorites, this is, I'll show you Andre's favorite. Andre is obsessed with the cereal milk scent from Confectionery Soaps Co. Like, he loves it. It literally smells like cereal. Like, I don't know what he says, like Cheerios or basically a cereal in milk. Like that's literally what it smells like and he's obsessed with it. But these two, I think, have just become my new favorites. So the hair serum, which I don't talk about enough, I plan on doing a full hair video, but I started using her hair serum early-ish 2020 and my hair really grew. And I have the teas and cakes scent of that and I love it. Now this scent is even better. This is the Medakesh scent, but the teas and cakes scent basically smells like my childhood. So I have this, oh, this is a hand spray. Teas and cakes, I sprayed it over my body. Whatever, I'll just be sanitized everywhere. And then look how cute this little bath bomb is. It looks like, it looks like my sweater. Isn't that so cute? It's got the little tree and everything. Okay, and then there's like some gifts and some treasures and some little straws and stuff. I'm so excited. There's a bath bomb. There's a sweet chopping knife. Look at this knife. Andre's like, that's freaking nice. Okay, well, let's get to baking now and I think I'm gonna, let's, let's put on a Christmas movie. Let's do that. Let's do that thing where we put on a Christmas movie. By the way, the scrunchie is from Sewing Sweethearts. It's another one of those scrunchies like I had in the other day. I freaking love them. They remind me of my childhood. Things that remind me of my childhood make me so happy. <laughs> All right, so we cooked, we cleaned somewhat. The stuff is just steaming right now, and I've got some jazz music on. We watched the Nutcracker. I will share the recipe for that Christmas pudding in the description below. It's pretty simple. The key is really just to make sure that it steams for, I think it's like three plus hours. So right now, what I'm going to do is probably go read a little bit just in our cozy bed with our Christmas lights. All the Christmas lights are over the bed. I love the vibe in here with my Mickey lights and everything. So I'm gonna get curled up. I might edit a little bit and I'm gonna call it a night. This has been like a really chill vibe type of vlog, but I'm into it. And I just wanna leave you guys with something. I kind of poured my heart out today on Instagram. So if you didn't see today's post, definitely go check it out. Um, share those three things in the comments below. And I know it's been a weird year, but it's definitely been like through this little community, this little family, it's definitely been a special year. So definitely go check out that post. I'm not gonna regurgitate it to you guys, but definitely go check it out and just know that I truly care more than you will probably ever know. And you guys mean the world to me. So 
make sure that you are subscribed, give the video a thumbs up if you liked it, if you like the vlog style. I hope you guys have a great Christmas and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye dudes. Oh it's time for Christmas. Oh it's time.